Wait, Stream is Welcome back to more. More in the last episode, we got our carries. Three letters that he somehow lost while flying through here. And then once we return, returned them to him, we found out the guy literally lost him throughout the whole entire kingdom. Thanks, Postal Service. Why I never get my packages. Stormers. Um, yeah, I told you guys that. And then we did we did a few battles, almost reaching that to level, level up, and talk about a story about what happened at school, but besides that. Um Oh yeah, and also really quickly I um got the peekaboo badge off screen. But I, I don't have it equipped because I don't have enough BP. That's okay, because we all know. That's okay, because we all know once when I level up, I'm choosing I'm choosing BP. Anyway, enough of that. Let's get on. Let's get moving. So now that we have Park Harry with us, as much as I don't want him to be with us, um, we can we can do a few things. Oh wait, I want to go back. I want to go back to that Monty Mole because. I can show off Park Harry's moves. Okay. With Park Harry here, we got Skydive. Kick an enemy. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, isn't that what, like, what any old man, male man can do is just kick something? Hmm. What you want to do is, um, before the attack, you just want to um, press A while landing it. It's like Mario's jump, just you want to land it. Pretty simple. I am getting really well at my um, guarding this game. And then, and then for um, Park Harry's next move, don't want to do skydive, skydive again. Want to do shell shock? Attack an enemy into the air. Bumping it by bumping into it. Okay, these are like generic mailman moves. Anyway, basically, press the um, controller to move, to move left and release when it's aiming when aiming at the target. Basically, you line it up. Try to line it up, and there you go. It does a lot of damage though, and I do think it can um, penetrate um, clefts. Oh wait, that box responded and it's just god damn shit. Oh. And we're back, and guess what? We leveled up people. As we talk just talked about, I am going to choose BP. <laughs> Screw the sleepy sheep. Just screw the sleepy sheep. Oh, um, about last video, you know how I was like, I said I was coughing. Yeah, it turns out it wasn't just any old cough. It was just a cough of me having an itchy throat and all that. I think I'm kind of sick. I'm not sure. Being honest. And here we go. I'm gonna set the PB badge on. And now, you all don't even have to worry about me saying, I think, I think, I think about this enemy's HP, uh, the relief. Let's just have some fun. <laughs> so yeah, how you all are enjoying stuff? Um, the Yoko Watch 2 movie just came out, and it's really interesting. It, I didn't get to go see it, because it only showed up at 11, and things happened around 11. Yeah, this is one of the optional things you can do with Park Area, or well, not optional, it's, it is optional, but just... You got the Quake Hammer Badge, slightly damages all enemies on the ground or ceiling. You might want to quit this badge, because later on there are going to be enemies that do hug onto the ceiling. 
or at least not later on, but soon, soon to be. Oh, and I guess now I can, um, I can test, um, us doing, doing the thing with, um, hard carry here. Do not want to jump on that! Okay. Hit with the hammer, there we go. Yeah. Okay, I guess we can, we're, we're, we're gonna test it out now. Yep, it does affect clefts. And as you can tell, clefts only have two defense points. So there you have it, because um hard carries on um, shell shock does five damage. To our regular enemy. But now that you have hard carry, um backtrack um Mount Rugged a little bit more because you're gonna notice there's a lot of items out there that you kinda that you don't get that you don't have yet. And I want those flower points. And dang it, they're gone. Just dang it, they're gone. Well, that sucks. And I did not mean to fall off. Today I'm just screwing up a lot, aren't I, guys? Just screwing up. Oh yeah. Um. Now we can talk to this bubble here because we have park carry. Huh? You're talking to me? Uh, yeah, I'm talking to you. I didn't see anyone el else around here. Alright, well, maybe you didn't see anyone because you were underground. Are you talking to me? I... I've been a long- it's been a, it's been a long while since I first came here from my home, Bellower B. Olds. Foreshadowing a little bit there. But you're still- but you're still the very first person to speak a word to me. Nobody ever notices me. Maybe because you're underground, but I do feel that. Nobody talks to you but me. The few people I actually see just think I'm blooming. That would make odd sense. Like, how could a desert... Grow, I mean, desert? I mean, how could a flower grow in a desert? Well, besides, okay, if you're a nearby oasis. There was a waterfall in Mount Rugged, but I don't think this bulb, this bulb, bulb was, like, really close by that waterfall, so... Yeah, I'm gonna call it Ill illogical. I love a good conversation. Here, take this as next. This is a sp precious seed. Keep it, keep it well, and remember me. Yeah, with all the chit chat and uh, aside, you got the magical seed. And yeah. please grow my seed with care. I'll be, I'll help. It'll help you one day. One day. Um, flower field. Um, I'm not gonna, like, let's just say we're not gonna be, like, we're not gonna be going there for a long time. I mean, we'll get there at one point, but just not gonna be there for, we're not gonna, um, make it there for a long time. People who play this game, this game, you kinda know what flower field is. Yeah, I'm just using speedy spin here just to fast track um, through this through this area of Mount Rugged. Cause like once past here, once we're like um about leaving the Mount Rugged, we're gonna um, be facing something a little strong. A little side note. And hey, Star Piece. And if 
I recall, I think that is everything. If not, we'll um we'll do it on the backtrack of Mount Rugged because obviously we are gonna be backtracking here. Well, I mean we are gonna be coming back here once this like chapter is over. Little kind of spoiler, not really. <laughs> Anyway, when, enough with that, let's actually, um, move on to getting out of Mount Rugged. So, yeah. Uh, my voice sounds a little different. I guess that might be from my sore throat. Use Park Harry right here and get you over the bridge. Now, right here. See that? Um, I think it's, yeah, it's a vulture. See that vulture? Yeah, he ain't gonna stay staring away from us. But let's not worry about him too much. Let's just walk along the bridge and hey, there. Love a second, Arden. Just a darn minute. I've seen you somewhere. You have, or you haven't. I always got claws, he needs it. Ooh, what's the letter you got there for? Yep, very similar. You look a lot like this fella Mario who's on Bowser's wanted poster. Oh well, he actually put wanted posters with me? So I must have been what he was doing when I was out. Now, give, what's your name? Okay here. Guys, get this. You say Mario, he'll attack you. you say Luigi, he won't attack you. you. Say Peach, he'll attack you. So choose whatever one you want. I mean you want the f I mean, obviously I'm gonna fight this guy for the experience, but I'm gonna choose just saying I'm Mario. Mario! Well, it'll be. If you're Mario, I reckon I got you, got you bust over here. I cannot speak Western for the life of me. And here's your mini boss. And I forgot to heal. <laughs> Refund working at its best. Oh, this attack! Press aim um, repeatedly just uh, because. <coughs> oh, dang it, Park Harry's injured. That's great. But yeah, that attack. You want to press aim repeatedly because basically that attack just. The, the, lo the more you don't press A, that the more damage it's gonna do. The more you press A, it's gonna do at least damage. Oh, and then this attack right here. Yeah, if you don't escape, you get damage. Oh, and this guy's name, by the way, if you want to know. Name is Buzzard. Yeah. Park Harry, you're up and fine, and I'm about to take really good damage here. Refresh is so useful right now because literally, it's just I, I just use refresh more than using an item. And yeah, I didn't do that when when we, when we started the fight. So, yeah. Woo! 
doing shell shock here just to do some damage. Oh yeah, the bigger the enemy is, the more the more easier time you'll have of, t of um getting a good shot with shell shock. And um, here I, I finally I escaped that. That was me. So yeah, the bigger the enemy is, the more better you'll have of just like taking it down. I chose power bounce today. Oh, and then this attack. He acts like he's a super great ninja, and then, well, bam, he just throws some feathers at your face. Yeah. If I'm gonna, like, run low on HP, I'll just use that, um... I'll just use that, um... Mushroom in my inventory. That way, I don't waste too much um good recovery items. I'm not using the weapon bomb. That's like last resort item. What mash! Oh, I got one damage. That's that's kind of rare. I mean, usually you'll end up taking two, but. Hey, at least, um, Power Curry's out for only one turn. That was just a terrible job. But MASH! No! No! How? Well, hey, I'd say I'd use that mushroom. We were running low on HP. Now's a great time. And I swear he better not do that um that one flying attack at me again because I don't think I can take another hit. Do here, what do I want to do? And I just might want to lay some damage on this guy. Um. Really, I'm just having a hard time here because I get I don't want to get a game over. And although if I did get one, I could at least show you what the animation looks like. But just right now, I don't even know what to do. Just like. I'm trying to think it out, would it, would it be a good idea to list one of my super shrooms or just like try and see if the close call badge would work for me? Yeah, I'm not sure about this right now. And then on the other hand, I'm trying to think if the close call badge works, um, then my star energy would be like at close full and I could use refresh again. I think I'm just gonna use a super shroom because I can't. I'm not, um. I don't have, um. Like. The safety of me just, like, knowing the same. Close call badges and you're working with me. And I made a good call. Died there. Oh. Well, there's me. My smarts working. This guy's got 5 HP. We can survive. But yeah, we can definitely survive. Oh, this guy's gonna be like hanging 1 HP. That sucks now. But mash! But mash! Good, we're safe. Now, you must. Die. I don't care if I screw this up. You die. The end. Get 15 star points. 
Now I got whooped. And I guess he committed suicide by just flying off. Anyway, we want to go down this mountain because we're going to reach Dry Dry Desert right after. Oh, no, we're not yet. Heart block. Definitely, we need that heart block. And save block if we need it. And right here, we made it to dry, dry desert. Now, just up ahead. Looky who, guys. It's, it's Mr. Famous. Famous, guys. Yeah. But what we want to do right now is... We want to pull out Cooper. Because we said it. Because Cooper said if he were to see Colorado, he'd be a little bit happy. Why, hello there, old boy. How goes the travels, eh? And no, as Colorado, I am an archaeologist, you know? I travel the world. I kind of know. I do diaries. At the moment, I am turning Dry Dry Desert upside down to find the dri to find the Dry Dry Ruins. Hey, you never know. It could be under your nose. My assistants have attempted to gather information in Dry Dry Outpost, which is near which is near here. Sadly, as yet of sadly as of yet, we're having little success. All I need is a clue. Uh, you mean a blues clue? I'm so sad for remembering that. And we'll be golden. What? 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 Whoa! You're a professor. Colorado? You didn't listen to him. I mean, hey, Trifan. It's it's Cooper. I live next to you. It's so great to see you. I never would have expected to meet you up with you out here. I live next to you. I wish I could have been you. I wanted to be one of your best assistants. I hope I'm your number one employee. I mean, I'm in, in the middle of my own expedition with Mario. I want to be an archaeologist just like you. Well, there you go. Kids got a dream. Hello there, Cooper. It's been ages. What do you mean ages? Like, have we not talked to him for years? Or what? How long have you been out here anyway? So if you're if you're serious about taking up archaeology, you and I should go exploring someday. Wow, this guy's great. At least he's not being a jerk famous. He's being the cool, fun famous where if you want to be like me one day. It's like that, you know. I'm trying to think here. The closest person I can think of is people who like want jobs like firefighters or like police. Like those guys and the police officers are always nice about it, just being all Hey, you wanna grow up like me? Do good in school. Be a good person. They say something like that. And this is just like one of those moments right now. Anytime, really. For now you concentrate on your adventure with Mario. You never attain such frame in your archaeology as I have if you don't finish one task before starting the next one. Oh, okay. As soon as we're done saving the princess and Mushroom Kingdom and everything, you and I- Oh, am I spaghetti, by the way? You and I will go exploring. Ah, uh, that's- that's- that's really cute. Alright, it's time to be the mail. Alright, it's time to have the mail service. It's time to have- to be the mail service, because remember, we got a letter for Colorado. And he's here, so why not just let's give it to him. Okay. 
So basically, just skip all the boring dialogue that he says again. You're Colorado, correct? The name Park Harry. I deliver letters that I somehow lost all over the entire world. I believe I have one for you. Hang on a moment. Yeah, this is your letter that I somehow didn't lose. And the worst part is he just hands it to him. Another letter, dull, dully delivered. The postman's job is never done. Well, yeah. Oh, good show. It's a letter from my. It's a letter from my wife. Oh, that cannot be good. I mean, hey, family. Thank you so. Thank you ever so. Oh, chap. This is just what I need to get my strength going. Go on. I know. I'll pass this along as a spot of the thanks. I came across, I came across it while I was in, um, summer, submerging in the de in the dig around here. Get a star piece. Well, hey, I'm down for it now. If I'm getting a star piece just for being the mailman, the better mailman, then I'll take it. The good thing is, he doesn't even get it. Good thing is, I mean, Power Carry doesn't get it. Anyway, we found Professor Colorado. We took down a vulture who wanted my head. Up heads. And we got a few optional things. Next time on Paper Mario, we explore Dry Dry Desert. See you guys 